back to another episode of Cindy's Kitchen. I'm Cindy. Hey, hey. Behind the camera is Michael. Michael, say <laughs> hi to everybody. Hey, everyone. And this is my little place where I do all my recipes. That's, That's right. all you guys know. Thanks for watching. And thanks, thanks everyone. And thanks for tuning in to Cindy's Kitchen. This, uh, I think, afternoon already because it's 12.46 on the almost East Coast. It's almost 2 o'clock. That's right. And it will be almost 11 o'clock on the West Coast. What do we got going so on here? So we are going to make fish tacos today. Fish tacos. Now, my oil is getting hot. Which that looks like shrimp. Vegetable oil. Yeah, uh, shrimp tacos. I said fish. Yes. But I'll show you Is it shrimp a fish? fish? Of course. You know, fish. comment in the section down below and tell us if shrimp is a fish. Michael, can you like... Don't back it up, back like it up. Like All right. So as uh, yesterday, I made some uh, regular tacos with ground beef. That's right. And more or less, I had like the same condiments. I, I got some uh, red onion chopped up in little squares. Some Check. Uh, half of uh, a white onion, some That's cilantro. Right. I took a Roman tomato. I didn't have any more toma canned tomatoes. So I took one of my Roman tomatoes from my salad and I cut it up and diced it in little squares. I threw some oregano in there. Uh, there's also some green pepper, as you can see, and jalapeno, green and pepper, jalapeno green pepper. that I cut, okay? That's right. So, and I put oregano. Okay. So that's what I have in there. And then here, done. I have a bag of shrimps that I got. I think these are the little ones, right? Shrimp so what I did was, I put it in this uh, colander. Actually, wild shrimp. And I drain all the water, as you can see. Still has a little bit of water. But I drain all that water out. You know what? Now what I'm going to do? no moisture when you fry them, right, Mom? get hot. A little bit of jalapeno fell in there. Ooh. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to put these in that area. Try it, try it, try it. And these are what? We're going to do it fast. Wow, look how fast they're cooking, everybody. Yes, they're going to cook fast. So how fast do they cook exactly? They're going to cook very fast. Well, what's, what's, what's very high? fast? You see how they're doing that? Like two one minutes, minute, minute and a half, something three like minutes. That. Oh, okay. And then if you move a little bit over, what I want to do is I want to take three of these. We're using balls. a hard, hard taco shell, guys. Three taco You can use shells. soft too, but we like using hard. I used hard. to buy those tacos for like eighty-nine cents. They're a dollar now, and they're like twelve. So I put three in the oven. You see my oven on four hundred. That's right. And while that is getting ready, there, what I'm gonna do, I am going to season my shrimp. Season up, season up. We're gonna season put some salt. I like that. Check. And we're gonna put some pepper. That's right, pepper, right, like pepper, that. right, black pepper. And we're gonna put some garlic powder. Garlic, I'm just, garlic, you know, putting it in. Yes. Because I get I eyeball it because I know what I'm doing. But if you don't know what you're doing, just put like a teaspoon. I'm you can always it. measure if you want. I Ingredients know, in the description down and below. And then taste it if you like the way it tastes. A little bit of cumin. Up, a little bit of cumin. Just All right. Up. Definitely chili powder. Ooh, chili, yeah, chili, yeah. Along with the jalapeno. That's right. You want to have it that it, kick. It's gonna pop it up. That and flavor, that some pop. Smoked paprika. Smoked, not regular paprika. It has that wood. That's right. But I'm not gonna put a lot. Well, why not? Not a lot, but just a little bit, a little sprinkle, because it's Ooh, very strong. I like yeah. how that looks. And you see how it's looking? Oh yeah. So it's on high. You Look probably can already smell it, didn't you, Mike? Oh yeah, it smells like seafood here, guys. So now here, what guys. I'm gonna do with this is yes. See how it is? Oh yeah. We're gonna put all the seasoning inside. You see that sauce, bro? That it's making right away. That's from all the coloring. So what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna put my onions, my jalapeno, my green pepper, my tomatoes, my red onions chopped up in square, my yellow onion cut up in pieces, yeah. and the oregano that I threw in pour there. Pour it in, pour, pour it in. Exactly. We're gonna pour all that because we're gonna cook wow. all that together. And we're gonna cook it until it's it delicious. Dries out. It's already delicious. See? See how it looks? Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. And let's not forget the taco so shells in the know, oven. I know the taco shells are good. And at 400, so everybody. What I'm, gonna do, I'm gonna take my finger like this and pass it through the back of the spoon. That's like right. That. You gotta always try your food, everyone. And like, what's it need? Put, not really anything. I'm just gonna put a little bit more salt. They're perfect. Salt it up, salt it up. Just like that, and then this line, we're gonna squeeze the line. Yes. For the, and the sour part. You want the citrus acidity of the, the lime. Acidity. We're gonna use lime. That's right. Uh, you know they call it lime here, but we call it limon, and then they call lemon the yellow one. Or limon. Yeah, but limon. I, like the, I like the green one better. Some well depends, you know. You know, to be honest, I like the green one. I like them both. It's more they sour. Different. I like the, the, the green The yellow is good. It tastes more summertime, just, more Caribbean-y. Yes. The green one. Yes, Caribbean. like you're on a tropical island. Like you're on a more tropical, more kind of like you can taste the flavor of the thing. That's right. You know? But here are my shrimp. They're Woo! going. 
Cooking up, cooking up. They only need like three minutes to cook. That's right. They don't need any more than that. While they're cooking, and now I'm gonna go down there, and uh, because I know that these shells are done. Those That's two right. shells are done. That's right. That's the shells that I'm gonna use. For, shell it uh, up, shell it yeah, up. Yeah, don't do this if you don't have experience. Don't try this at home because she is a trained professional. Yeah, you don't want to do that. We're gonna pull these off over here. So when we, this is done, hey right, guys. Yes. And uh, that's my lettuce that I'm gonna put in the tacos. Taco shell, so taco shell. Adding some of this lettuce in my tacos. We're gonna put them here. Iceberg three lettuce. Of them. And this is some hot sauce. You can put Tabasco, anything that's right. that you want. Oh, I'm gonna eat them the right way. The, the way the they side. should be eaten. So this is what I'm gonna do. You don't have to, like, you don't have to do things that you don't want to. But if you wanna put, like, more vegetables or whatever you want, you can always do that. What I'm gonna put, I put flakes of carrots you know, around it. And now we're almost done with this. Let me just put it here for now. A uh, carrot with uh, mm -hmm. shrimp? Yeah. Oh. You just put it on the top, see? Oh. How beautiful that looks. Mm. Beautiful. And it didn't cost me that much. We paid for the shrimp for like, was it eight bucks, Mike? That's right, nope, uh, $5.49. Yeah, it was on sale. Because there was other shrimp, they looked really frozen. No, but And these like, were wild I wanna, caught. You know I want to get? get a pound of the big, big ones, because I want to make a ditch. You know what, jumbo shrimp, the our jumbo. next video recipe. They have these ones, remember when we used to live in Florida, I used to come home yeah. from the hotel, I used to work with these shrimps, they were like a pound and a half of one shrimp. What are they called? Jumbo no, shrimp. No, no, they have another name. Uh, uh, not shrimp. Uh, lobsters? Uh-uh. They have Crawfish. Uh no. They have another name. Uh uh oh, I know. Prawns. Prawns. There you go. I got it, I got it. Look how pretty this looks. Ooh, it's smoking. It's smoking. So I'm gonna take one baby shrimp guy because you know how it is. And I'm gonna taste it. Test it up, test it up. Oh. Come on. Mm. How is it? Yes. No, maybe so. Well. Hey. Thumbs up? The last tasha. Thumbs up, thumbs up. A little bit of old bay. Old bay. Old bay bay. Old bay bay. This is shrimps. Woo. Whoa. Okay. Smell that, Mike? It's so smoky. Mm -hmm. Smell that? Yeah. How do you like that? How do I like it? Mm -hmm. I want some right now. Right. You know delicious? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm starving. Like Look at home. that. Let me try another shrimp shrimp. After I put a little bit of old bay. And while bay. she tries that, everybody, don't forget to hit that like button. Hit the notification bell so you get notified of every it's upload okay. that we make it's here at Cindy's Kitchen. So it's eating in shrimp, lobster, yes. fish. Yes. You know, because that's where it smells like Lobster, fish, sink. crabs, everything. But it's eating, you can Crab, shrimp, salad, lobster, fish. You want. And it is good and great. Now that's I'm right. I'm going to take my line. Squeeze it in, squeeze don't it squeeze in. Don't squeeze it all the way. Pay attention, Michael. I don't want you squeezing the lime or the lemon, whatever it is that you have so hard you want to squeeze it but not that hard because you don't want to taste the resin of the skin right so the the right rind the actual exactly. little bits like how when you get orange juice there and there's pulp in it you don't want the pulp of the that lime in there do that lime what is it right now which just makes all the flavors up together what it do and what it do here you got your shrimps they're done already we're gonna go over there let me turn this off because we're going to like prep. I'm going to put it in here, Mike, okay? Oh, yeah. Put that on the other side. Now, what we're going to do is, excuse me. Oh, I just got to take a picture of that mind. beautiful shrimp. What I'm going to do is, uh, oh. we're going to fill these out. All right. So, we're going to put like a little bit, you know, you put your little lettuce there. You know, and you take, what, one, two, just a little lettuce. You want to put those uh, things in there. Yes or no, Michael? That's right. Right? I'm gonna put some of you gotta shrimp. eat shrimp tacos the way they were meant to be eaten. Inside those tacos. That's yeah. right. And make them special. You see how I'm holding make them, Make them special, guys? make them special. I'm holding them in my hand. Now with this. Well, this you know, you could've just put them on the plate. No, I'm so you don't burn yourself, food. mama. I'm not burn myself, but. Okay, I know what I'm doing, eh? So that one, like this, and if they fall, they're gonna fall right in there again. That's right. In the, in the, in the pot that I have the shrimp. That's right. So each taco is going to have like three to four shrimps in there. Oh, yeah. And here you guys have your uh, shrimp tacos for the day. 
and I'll put a little bit of a lettuce like that just to decorate the plate. And uh, I'm gonna take. Okay, hold on a second. I'm gonna take. Well, I don't want no carrots of mine. You don't? Oh. No. So I'm gonna put just some like that. You know what I'm saying? So before I gave it to you, so you know, it looks pretty. So with that, guys, I'm gonna let you guys go, and I'm gonna let you guys uh, tell you guys. Don't forget to subscribe and look us up on Instagram, on Twitter, on Facebook, on Pinterest, and everywhere. So uh, here's your uh, shrimp tacos. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit that notification button. And with that, I'm going to let you guys go. Don't drink and drive. And see you tomorrow for another episode of Cindy's Kitchen. Thanks for watching and good day, everyone.